Hi guys, how you doing? Just make sure the camera's on. Uh, so today we have um, a demo lesson. Well, it's a demo. It's, it's not really a demo. Yesterday we did the teacher training and now the teachers, I don't know if you can see behind me there, they're playing. We brought kids in and the teachers are doing the games and activities with the kids, which is cool. And then I'll be listening to them and giving them feedback on uh, what they're doing wrong, what they can do better. Uh, a lot of them uh, are really good, good teachers, but you know, from, a, from an extra po external point of view, I can see what they need to work on, whether that's uh, getting the kids louder, uh, we had a problem before with some of the kids not using the full grammar, they were just using words, which is cool, we can fix that. And also, what else do we have? Oh yeah, kids asking the meanings and the teacher's going to translate. Um, so instead of that, it's like, no, ask the kids to guess and see what it is. Uh, and then we give feedback. You can get some way of having this external feedback, someone to watch your teaching, you will learn so much, it's amazing. And the best way to do it is to video your lessons. So we're videoing all my sessions, I look back, I see how I'm doing, see what I'm doing right, see what I'm doing wrong, uh, and you can pick it up. So that's my top tip for today, is to video your lessons, um, and then look at them back later, and you will learn so much, and there you go. And if you can get, come to my workshops or whatever, we don't always do this, but if you can come to my workshops and get real life feedback, and also see different groups going different ways, that's an amazing way to increase your ability as well. But uh, I'll just let you check out some of the kids here. So we're just doing under the sea. And I also want to check on the teachers, how much local language they're using. And also, oh, now this teacher's good. She's got the kid doing the game. These kids have never done this lesson before, which is pretty cool. And we're also short on space, if you notice. So we've just modified the game a little bit so that we have better space and things. And then we've got the parents in the back. They're using mobile phones, so I'm going to tell the parents off now. And I'm going to get the parents involved. We're going to do the next lesson. There we go. So that's uh, pretty cool. So I'm Richard. I'm Richard from Genki English. Uh, this is going to be pretty cool. And I want your lessons to totally transform from where they are now to be really great with awesome kids like these who love speaking English, do it in big voices, ask lots of questions, and the teachers love it. Catch you later.